time here. It's Oregon. Look at all the mountains. Why, what? Wait a second, she's in Oregon? Yes, I know you probably ask yourself, what happened? Where is she right now? And what happened in between? So let's just kind of go reverse and see what happened before I came to Oregon. Maybe sadness that I carry Lost the woman now and marry Please be gentle but slow And still try to let go So hard when it's been years I have to love a love you I love you Okay, so it's one day after Christmas and it's going to be like you're really lazy, being relaxed <laughs> day. I'm just heating up some kind of leftovers from Christmas and also the day before. Um, and I tell you, there's a lot of cake, too much cake. Look at this. This is like one cake, then we have the German cake that I bake. Let me see, what else do we got here? We got cookies and I already ate like, I guess four of those today. Like this is pain chocolat, it's like um, croissant with chocolate in it too good i tell you and yes my sister just went out actually i guess an hour ago um i just had a bath kind of to relax today and excuse me because i got like a gift with some spa products like a robe and also some oil and some epsom salt for uh bathing uh that's why i used this to kind of also detoxify my body from all the <laughs> food, all the sugar that, that I was eating. Um, yes, and I'm waiting for my sister to come home because we're gonna have like a video rest of the day, I guess. Um, let's see if we're watching like a really favorite movie series um, together. I'm not sure if she likes those kind of movies. <laughs> But maybe we'll give it a try. Hey, Kimberly. <laughs> okay, you got me. You got me. I got you, right? So, what are we gonna do tonight? Tell the audience. We're gonna watch Lord of the Rings. Oh, yes. yes. You got us right. <laughs> yes, I was born ready for this. You see? <laughs> <laughs> and we look like twins now with our... Yes. How do you call this? Our little blonde. Right got here. it. In Germany, we say when oh, women have this on the top, it's their onion. Oh, okay. <laughs> Anyways, okay. Back to the movie. Okay, hello, I'm back. I'm having like a little snack. I just went to Sprouts and get some sourdough and some coat cheese and I put like some dried tomato on top. I really love it. It doesn't seem really nice. But I and I have some leftover German chocolate nut cake that no one was eating because I add like coconut sugar in it and the taste was so different that I used to know it um, and just like at the third day it went like really good and so I will just have some dessert for later I put some other slices in the freezer so that I can take out 
and take with me for my travel on Saturday because this is the day where I continue with my travel and this seems like this seems like this is going to be like my really solo female travel journey but of course I've went to my dad and my sister but this was kind of different and now I just really continue with my travel and visit many places um, and I'm really really excited about that so I'm wrapping up like the last day so now it's Thursday and on Saturday morning I will uh, go and fly take my flight and I'm so excited because it feels like something really big is going to come and happen I'm volunteering and I figured like those places I will go they so amazing and my belly tingles when I just think about it well it's and like on the one hand it's like the time is really flying and on the other hand it feels like I've been here for a month already but it's been only four weeks not not four weeks almost four weeks I won't tell yet but it's getting excited it's getting excited mm -hmm. Alrighty, I thought today I will just take you guys with me uh, on my last day. Right now I just saw I can do the online check-in because tomorrow I will fly before I continue with my journey. Um, I'm having an overlay in Denver, Denver. See that I'm doing this on New Year's Eve. But well, I'm traveling in the morning, so I guess it's fine. Oh, thus. Oh man. Okay, this was something, but I checked in, so everything is prepared for my travel for tomorrow. This is going to be a really great day because today, well, I will just pack like everything and have already put my stuff out that I will wear tonight to the concert I'm going to. I am so, so excited, I cannot tell you. It's crazy because it turned out like this concert is going to be like small, like not a huge like event that's going to happen. So it's going to be like in a private house. So I think I'm going to be really in touch with the artists that are going to be there. Uh, it just feels like, like a groupie, you know? like being so nervous and like can i take a picture with you like a teenager and like, oh i don't want that mm. let's see if i can change my excitement and my nervousness till then and feel more grounded and strong woman yes i guess that i'm all set today will be again a whole computer day i think i need more adventure and more stepping out of my comfort zone and hell yes don't let me stop because of my fear reality check everything is all right i'm safe i am strong and i can hold myself you know this is what i really realized being a strong wild woman and travel just by myself with my backpack yes this sounds like plan huh <laughs> This is the stuff that I'm leaving behind. Um, it's like the rope that I got for Christmas, some books, um, like my wool dress and another dress. Okay, I didn't do the editing yet. I was on Instagram, so I wanted to collect like more kind of questions about like my story with my dad and with my family in general um, and I just did some stories about it to ask the people what they wanted to hear more from me and because I just talked to a friend the other day like yesterday um, and I update my friends with like a kind of more private video about how 
I struggled and like kind of more the deep insights and she said Olivia why don't you share more about your struggles and I thought okay I don't know I thought I really I like shared a lot like too much from my <sighs> privacy not privacy like my like this private stuff you know and I thought I will just go in touch with you guys um and just put in the comments what you wanted to know about my struggles, about the connection to my dad, and everything that comes up to your mind. Don't be shy. Uh, I was thinking about it to make like a Q and A uh, video, like an extra one on YouTube to upload it, uh, that other people really can resonate with. And yes, no, they're not alone. And it's a weird situation. It's still weird because like so many things all the time happen and like the whole story of my family is getting more and more weird um and i'm really s trying to figure out what's going on and putting like all the pieces together yes i'm trying to be like with an open heart and open mind on the other hand i just wanted to give like my anger my sadness my frustration room um Okay, I will put some eggs and bacon in the pan. <laughs> I will eat that. And hopefully I will start editing because it's taking ages. Still didn't so add scared. yet. Just another so episode that I will go. And I, and just ended I promise. On the side of the highway. <laughs> Guess what? I'm almost finished. So I have like 20 minutes and I cut everything and already put the music down. Um, and there's like the last thing I just wanted to go through it again and just to make some detailed cuts or something that I wanted to improve. This is it. So now I'm preparing some lunch, dinner, lunch because I'm hungry, actually starving, and I wanted to eat something. I just have some chicken in the fridge. Really amazing, thank you. Okay, it's official. I'm just getting ready for tonight for the concert. Whew, I'm so excited. So, let me see how you can see. This is what I'm wearing right now. And this is my outfit that I wear. Woo! <laughs> this is how I look now. Ready for tonight. So actually, yeah, it's just simple. Jeans, like this shirt, some earrings, some like ready for Logan Bowden. I will just document this really quick. So here it is. And I'm so excited. <laughs> Audible over the summer because I was cutting, um, cutting yards and I wanted to listen to books. Has anybody ever used Audible? Yeah. 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 All right. Cool. To watch our babies grow On the other side of town Where will I go? I will follow The tracks go drink But I don't know if I can swallow If I'll taste anything This next song is called Fur um, God, I don't even know what it means be perfectly honest, I really don't. <laughs> it's kind of one of those. We come home to the place we know Through the thick and the terrified Bet I'll find your animal Dreams when you choose a kiss from the 
valley girl when dead leaves blow. Okay, people, it's getting serious. I'm leaving high school today. Yesterday in the car, I already cried because I was all over the place. It was crazy after the concert. And yes, now I'm getting all my stuff and taking the next flight to Oregon. <sighs> the adventure is starting, I tell you. Okay, maybe I'm gonna cry, I'm not sure. But let's see, it's, it's really crazy because I just rem remember when I came here and now it's like three weeks later. Can you believe it, Kimberly? I can't, it went by fast, it's so fast. fast. Okay, this is how like a real backpacker life looks like. So you almost died because of your backpack and of course another one. Goodbye, Kimberly. Bye. I found my way through the desert Pulled out my teeth when you flew Yeah, this is it. These were my last days. I can't believe I finally made it to Oregon. I was dreaming about this for so long. Another step out of my comfort zone. Even though I was so excited and I was afraid how everything is going to turn out. Travel alone and just let me guide by my heart, this higher power. I am so proud of me. Years ago I would never imagine this would be happening. Me alone with a backpack in the United States. With every step that I took and take, I need to trust. Trust that everything is working out. Trust that I am safe. Trust into God. It feels like taking a step in the air. It doesn't seem like I can see the next step, but apparently I step on solid ground. Stability, freedom, a shoulder to lean on. When I just think about it, everything seems so unreal, magical and true. Again, I finally made it. I will flow again. I thought I'd call up to tell you